I was alarmed to read this morning of um, figures uh, in relation to the morning after pill and the sale of it. And it seems that in some pharmacies, it has increased. It's it, some pharmacies have increased their sales of the morning after pill from 30 to 90 per week, which is is really astonishing. And you know, it, it, I mean, this is something that should be a last resort. And I think that, firstly, if, if it indicates that. Um, perhaps the, um, it is being used as contraceptive and you know women are, are therefore are young are young women in a lot of instances are, are putting themselves at risk of sexually transmitted diseases and secondly you know it has many side effects in terms of reproductive health and all sorts of problems down the line for young women so I mean it's something that I, I think I'd ask the leader to uh, ask the Minister for Health to perhaps look at maybe liaise with some of the pharmaceutical um, bodies to get more precise figures on this and perhaps consider raising the price of it. It was reduced in price from 50 euros to 15 euros sometime last year and you know that perhaps we should consider raising the price of it and having some sort of an awareness campaign as to the, the, the potential dangers of, of uh, partaking in this sort of uh, uh, contraception and the other bigger problem is the social problem and the fact that you know intercourse has become a lot more casual in the country and you know I do think that it's something that we would probably need to um, have have a debate well you know as part of a bigger debate but that the Minister for Health really um, should bring his attention to it thanks very much and and following up on what Senator Noon's if I'm understanding it correctly somewhat extraordinary suggestion that the right way to deal with the widespread use of the morning after pill is to increase the charge of it, uh, it would be a little bit like trying to reduce abortion by increasing the waiting list to 10 months. Thank you.